Hello, I'm Shox, and welcome back to the latest episode of The Witcher Wild Hunt. We are on the way to uh, find some bait for the griffin, um, and then hopefully figure out a way to slay him. All right, let's move forward. To find the hunter uh, that found the bodies, the five bodies of the the slain uh, of the slain guys from the commander, the slain uh, soldiers, I guess they were, and see what he has to say, where he found them. Maybe that gives us the, gives us a hint of where the griffin is right now, or where he will most likely be, so we can find him. So he has a hut in the forest out here, and I think the hut to our left is indeed the hunter's hut. So let's get off of here and see if we can talk to him. Anyone home? Must be out hunting. Well... Let's see if we can find him with our um, Witcher senses. Actually, let's switch to, if we go into the next fight, uh, let's see if we, um, let's use Kinetic Blast just to get us a way to escape. So here are the foot traps that we want to follow figure out where he went. Wait, what's that? Oh, we, we have to Trails examine fresh. him. His love just left home. Alright, so we just follow uh, the footsteps here. And hopefully find him. I think it says, like, there's an icon on the left here. Someone to talk to. Hello. You, Ms. Love. Shh. Hear that? Wolves? No. Wild dogs. Yes. More dangerous than wolves. More dangerous than wolves? Um, yeah. Dogs more dangerous than wolves? Don't think so. It's the truth. No, why? No, but I guess you're about to tell me. Wolves hunt to fill their bellies. Wild dogs kill for sport. Just like humans. Aye, they've learned much from us. Why not cruelty too? I'm hunting bigger game. The Nilfgaardians the Griffin killed. Where'd you find them? Ah, I see. You a witcher. That monster slayer they's talking about in the village. Mm -hmm. I'll show you, sure, but uh, I gotta kill those mutts before they hurt someone. Will you help? That is, if you don't mind blunting your silver blades on them. Uh, all right, let's do it. Sure, Griffin's not going anywhere. I need no. some Dogs practice anyway. So step careful now. Come on. These dogs been a problem for a while now. Since the war started, soldier on the march, he'll stop to rape a woman, strangle her, kill her man for a chuckle, even butcher a cow. A dog, a kick in passing, no more. So these stray mutts form packs. They're gaunt, guts stuck to their spines, covered in scabies. But they just won't. Too late. Attacked another one. Oh wow, that's like, uh, there's plenty of those. Gonna help it out. All right. See, I still have to get better at the evade mechanics. Um, just overall the the whole battle mechanics. Uh, yeah, the the 
targeting is really annoying that it, it's so hard to actually precisely target something. Oh, I think he's just shooting them, which is kind of nice. Yeah, like here, like why can't you lock on a freaking target when it's uh, like a bit away? Because it would not let me lock onto a target while it's um, like some, like let's say 30 feet away. Which is ridiculous. I mean, I know what target I want to attack 30 meters away. Or 30 foot away. Dieter. You know him. We served at the Lord's Manor together, where the Black Army's encamp now. He was a stable hand, I was the Lord's hunter. But that was before. Well, a long time ago. Sorry. Hope you weren't close. No. Not at all. So, can you show me where you found the Nilfgaardians? Alright, back to business. Griffin, know anything about it? Oh, not much. It's not my kind of game. You're his kind, though. Survival instincts alone ought to make you care. I walk silent through the woods. No Griffin can hear me nor spy me. All right, while we were um, doing this quest, we actually leveled up. We're level two now. So, um, yeah, let's just take a break right here. Go to the character panel and spend our ability point. When you've gained a certain number of experience points, you advance to the next level. You get experience points for killing monsters and completing quests. You receive ability points every time you gain a, gain a level. Using these points, you can acquire new abilities or improve ones you already have. Ability co abilities color indicates what branch it belongs to. Alright, what do we want? Fast attack. I already have that one. Muscle memory. Fast attack damage increased by 5% and we get more adrenaline. Planning a fast attack. So, I, I guess the, the question is like which one, um, which trait we want to go into. Signs, alchemy, general, um, vitality, regeneration. Oh, so this one is basically like you get tougher. That probably is not a bad one. They would just don't die that quickly. Um, what else do we have? So the question is, do we uh, want better fast attacks? I think um, the strong attacks need to be improved because we first have to, I think, just get better at, at using them. So crossbow, we don't have crossbows yet. Uh, Battle Trance. Blows la landed during combat generate adrenaline points. Each adrenaline point increases weapon damage by 10%. Oh, nice. So the more combinations or the longer we are in the fight, actually, the more damage we'll do. So the next level would be adrenaline points. Loss upon taking damage is lowered by 20%. Which is also not a bad one. Or this one, which gives us 5% flat. But I think I will go with... Uh, the flat 500 um, vitality just because oh we can't we can't select that one yeah no, we can't yeah there you go all right let's acquire this ability for an ability to take defect you must first activate it by placing it in any open ability slot inactive abilities will not have any effect so okay so you can um, only um, pick one at a time. All right, so uh, we should be much beefier now, hopefully. And ideally also dodge better so we don't need to be that beefy. But better safe than dead. And while we're at it, let's just save the game again. Just to make sure we don't lose too much when we die. And you never know if the griffin just, um, considering we, we just look at the place where they got slaughtered. It was here. One lay there, by the stump, headless. 
The other hung from a branch, guts splayed, stretching down to... Watch out for yourself now. Uh, we don't take sides, so... Not the first griffin I've dealt with. Not likely to be the last, either. Hope you're right. Good hunting now. Alright, this this looks bad. Holy crap, that guy just, like, went through them. Um, Alright, so let's use our hunter skills and examine what is going Ground on is or what black, is going on here. Saturated with blood. Nelth Guardians were celebrating. Griffin interrupted a camp. We hear a wolf somewhere around here. Yeah, they're they're wolves over there. But I don't necessarily want to attack them if they don't attack me. Um, so we're still looking for um, some more evidence I think um wait is this the is there buckthorn here why oh, not so examine the site where are those wolves oh, I can hear them like miles away I think so what else is there to be examined like the bush no there's some more uh, things we we might want to explore here or, or find out about what happened here. Oh, here uh, are footsteps or something like that. These prints are older and deeper, heavily armored. Elf guardians, probably. So there are more footsteps we might be able to follow. Oh, there's a fast travel point. All right. So it looks like they were coming through here. And there's a chest we just found. It looks like uh, there was something that fell down um, off the bridge. Oh, no, don't, don't stop hitting people. So we got an amateur's armor repair kit and some money. Great. Uh, we still don't know where those guys went. Back up here again? Wait, let's jump. Come on. Alright, that worked. So yeah, there are footsteps here that are going into the woods. And did maybe someone survive that attack? And I never can tell how close those wolves actually are. Oh, they're really close. They're like right next to us. Holy crap. And there are a bunch of them too. So we might want to be very careful around here. Alright, what is here? Like, can we examine this? Oh, this is where they came from. So they basically have to go around to find their, their footsteps again. They drop down here. So they came from up there, I feel. And we just have to follow. Yeah, <laughs> let's try jumping again. We just have to follow the footsteps and see where they lead us. Um, we have to hold B while jumping. Why do you not? Oh, there you go. I was running. Why are you not jumping? Can not take them? Okay, that's stupid. Griffin's nest. What remains of it at least. Oh, here's the Griffin's nest. So the the guys found the nest. And they came back from here. Female. Larvae in her wombs have already hatched. Been dead at least a week. Other Griffin must be a male. Deep cuts over the whole body. Not a drop of blood on the beak or claws. Didn't defend herself. Crept up on her while she slept. 
beak tips worn, gray hairs in the coat. Ten, twelve years old. Griffins pair off for life when young. Male must be about the same age. So I wonder what happened. Like, so it's like twelve years old. It's just they got, you know, more cocky and be like, well, nobody's gonna hurt us, so we just move here and slay everything. Thick shaft, dense barbs. A royal griffin. All right. So that they explains killed. why the male I ran into was so aggressive. Hunted the Nilf Guardians down here in the forest first, then started prowling the area. Alright, so the, the male one basically is, is just pissed that they they killed his his uh corpse is a couple of weeks old. Still alive when the griffin brought him here. His partner. Took a long time dying. Bones. Horse. Dog. Human. A few months worth. Alright, so we know that there is you know, one more griffin out there, and then that was his nest, but he's probably not coming back, um, you know, because of what happened here. And actually, let's let's take a look at our inventory. We just picked up a sword. And the question is, it is actually much better than our current sword. So we should totally use that one. Yeah, it's plus 12, um, and it is a, yeah, the steel weapon. That is great. So, oh, okay, so this one is armor piercing, plus 25, and this one has 4% higher crit, which uh, right now we're not really fighting too many things, too many enemies that have armor. Like, we're not fighting any uh, guards. We're not, we're mostly fighting... Um, Oh, whoops. We're mostly fighting animals. So... Is that a wolf down there? No. So we mostly fight the animals, so in, in that case we might as well just uh, use the higher damage, higher normal damage that is not against armor. And um, also... Let's hunt down that wolf. Okay. We're running away. All right, now I'm, I'm just slowly get the hang of how to um, fight those animals in general, how to fight and actually to evade and um, all those things. So let's see if there's anything else that we could. Um, interact with. There's some uh, herbs we can collect. But overall, uh, let's see if our horse is... Yeah, our horse is here. So let's just grab our horse and um, find some buckthorn in the riverbed. And then we're ready to slay, or at least attempt to slay the griffin, which would complete our first quest. And it's really good that we found the better sword. It has 25 or 20 more damage, I think. So that should make a big difference. And let's see, That's what it, does Rose. the... What does the exclamation mark mean again? I think it's a point of interest. So let's just um, figure out what was happening here. And if we can talk to someone here. Old one. Lost your key, ma'am? No, not me key, me pan. It's always sat there empty, this hurt. That is, till the night afore the battle. A man arrived, walked right in like to his own. Standing at the window, peering at the goings on. He must have made me, cause next I knew, there he was, coming my way. So, I grabbed me pan for protection, see? He just asks all polite. Gran, got any birch bark by chance? Lilac berries or even a few coals? Nay, says I. And you 
Must be right daft to pester folk at night with such foolery. Just staring at me pan like a magpie at a copper. Lend it to me, Gran. I'll give it back come morn. Baffled for what's he doing, frying in the dark. And I've got a soft heart, so I gave it to him. <laughs> it, it is a very fascinating tale. Fascinating story. Any chance you're nearing the end? <laughs> dawn, another rolled up to the hut. But come morn. Only the first fella left, locked the door, hopped on his horse, and that were all I saw of him, and me pan. T'were old, black with sort, not worth much, I suppose, but I've no other. Will you help me, dearie, bring an old widow or a pan? I could never break down that door myself, and in truth, I'm a fear to go in any room. Such a stench wafting out. Methinks the other fellow. Well, that he's lying there. Oh, yeah, fine, I'll help you. Not Never because. Never taken on a pan contract. The goodness of my fine, heart. I'll go in, look around. You should wait here, just in case. But it sounds like fun. So let's actually go in there, um, use my witcher senses to find stuff. And I think I have to, um, legs to dive or bees swim towards the surface. Alright. Let's go down there and actually, um, can you just please go towards it? And take some of this. Just fucking take it. There you go. All right, so we have. Should talk to Vesemir. Uh, yeah, we have. We have everything we need. So now let's go to Vesemir and actually let's swim back to the other side, so we um, have our horse again and go on to. You know, talk to Vesemir and hopefully he can help us fight the Griffin. Uh, our first encounter wasn't necessarily a good encounter, a very successful encounter for us, considering Vesemir was like hurt by one approach of the Griffin, and we didn't even really try to kill the Griffin. We just, you know, we're standing there by accident and took um, one hit at him. All right. Stop. Let's go back to the inn. Wait. Oh, we already passed it. Where is it? Run, Roach. Oh, come on, keep going forward. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, so... Let's go back to the inn. I remember it was here. We beat up the dudes. And, well, seems as he woke up, because it's no longer, um, lying in the hay where we beat him up and knocked him out. Alright, Vesemir, I found something. <laughs> Drunk guys over here. Oh, where's Vesemir? Wasn't he here? Looking for trouble. Hmm. Oh, is he waiting outside? Did I just like completely walk by him? That might totally be the case. Yeah, it looks like he's waiting outside and I just ran past him. There he is! What up, Vesemir? What do you do while I was gone? Just, you know, drink yes. and eat. What is it, Wolf? I have accepted a contract for the Got Griffin. good news and bad news. Good news first. Captain of the Nilfgaardian garrison knows where Yennefer went. And the bads that we have to kill the Griffin for. Ha, <laughs> he knew. What else could he want from two witchers? Go on. Tell me what you know. Griffin's abandoned its lair. Gotta make a lure, set a trap. And how's that going? Well, we're basically ready to go, aren't we? Learn some things. It's a male. Had its nest in the Vulpine Woods. 
The Nilfgaardians burned the woods down, killed its mate, smashed their eggs. Thought they'd fixed things. <laughs> it's always the same. Instead of sending for a professional, they try to do it themselves, only end up making matters worse. Well, Got the set a trap. Horn. Ought to work like a charm. Powerful scent. More like stench. City boy. Rotting meat, manure, piss. Standard smells of the countryside. Huh. Remember Tredegor? Yummy. Hunting that zoogle in the trash heap? You spent half the next day bathing, scrubbing yourself. How can I forget? You ever gonna stop bringing that up? <laughs> Fine. If everything's ready, say the word and we'll get to work. All right, it's time to set the no trap. Point in waiting. Let's find a good spot to ambush it. Picked one out already. <coughs> Other side of the stream. There's fields and a grove. Plenty of room and far enough so no one will get in our way. Good. Me there. All right, let's do it. Brewing potions. Prepare to fight the griffin by brewing the thunderbolt potion. All right, how do we do that? Alchemy. To create an item, you need the right ingredients. You can find a description of the item you created, and the types are on the left. All right, where is the thunderbolt potion? Thunderbolt. In order to use an item during gameplay, you must first be equipped using the inventory panel. I have a Witcher potion, but in order to use it, you must first equip it. So, um, let's find it. It is a Thunderbolt potion. Choose it and... Okay, so it might consumables and... I think I replaced the potatoes. Great, so what does it actually do? What is the effect of the potion? 25 for 100 toxicity, 30 second effect. Increases attack power. Yeah, that never hurts. So we're just uh, more beefy and can actually hit the griffin for more damage if I understand that correctly. All right, let's just get out of here and right towards where we're going to set the trap. On the double! Let's do it! Let's get rid Make of way. this griffin and find out where Jessica went or whatever the commander knows. But before we set the trap, we end this episode. Thanks so much for watching and I hope we see you next time when we will set the trap and hopefully slay the griffin. Thanks guys, see you next time.